Hi guys. It's time for some, some lunch. I'm hungry. I'm getting hungry. And of course in Malaysia, <laughs> in Malacca, you can eat good. You, you can eat really, really good food. But you know what, I, what I've noticed is when, when people talk about food in Malaysia, they often speak about Chinese food and about Indian food. But we're in Malaysia. So why don't I talk about Malay food, Malaysian food. Typical Malaysian food, yeah. And that's what I want to do. There's a, a very popular takeaway. Or you can stay, also eat there, but actually it's more for, for takeaway, you know. Uh, that, that serve uh, the old uh, Nazi, uh, Nazi shampoo. So it's, it's, it's right here, it's actually right in, in, uh, in Jalan uh, Kota Laksamana, you know. Very close to where I live. So let's check this out. Ah, uh, morning. Uh, see? The old Nazi shampoo. You've got all kinds of things, all kinds of uh, delicious curries and meats and tofus and eggs. So let me show a little bit. See, you got different kinds of chickens, and vegetables, fried chicken, fish, you know. You got curried eggs, eggs, deviled eggs, sausages, different kinds of so tofus, different kinds of vegetables. See this? Chicken, chicken. Ah, chicken, ah, yum. Very good, it looks very good. Yeah, See, in these nice great people, you can, you, can, you can order it with rice to take away, you can also only uh, order it by bag. So I'll, I, will, I, will, I will get some foods and then we'll eat it at home to show you. So, I bought lots of foods. And you can see people are showing up. This actually, yeah, they're coming from everywhere. It is, it is like 10 to 12. So people are coming. Uh, actually, yesterday were well, a lot more people here at the same time, but it was raining. It was just it just stopped raining. So let's go home and try. I'm sure this great Malay food, this Nazi shampoo. Okay, we made it home. I made it home without spilling anything. And actually, we even have some sun. I'm on. In, I'm, I'm in my yard. I'm in my garden, and I'm eating here all by myself. Well, actually, I'm pre-eating. I'm not eating everything. Everything you see here cost me 16 ringgit, which is not so bad. I would say that's less than $4. I would say that's like $3.60 US, of course, I'm talking about. Anyway, so what do we have here? Yeah, I couldn't film, you know, because, you know, I take it in little bags, you know, and then I, have, I don't have a cameraman yet. They can still apply for the job. You know, actually, the job my wife has, but she has to, you know, sometimes, you know, keep the children in check. That's why I'm all by myself now. Okay, so Nazi shampoo, which is a traditional, you know, lunch or dinner thing. Uh, as much in, um, in Indonesia as in, in Malaysia, I actually don't know uh, who had it first. Uh, it doesn't really matter now, right? That's it. Yeah, you know, they have, some of their cultures are very, very similar, you know, very, very close by. Uh, even, uh, yeah, like the language, it's kind of like identical, you know, of course, with, with few regional slang words or even more. Anyway, so what do we have here? We have the Nazi putti, so that means uh, the white rice, uh, plain of white rice, you know. We have uh, some vegetables, of course, you know. Uh, me, I try to get as many vegetables as possible, if it's possible. <laughs> Let me change that here real quick. Okay, okay. Yeah, okay, and then we have a serving or a double serving of tofu, you know, with a, you know, chili tofu, which is probably uh, also a little sweet, but let, let's, let's try this out. Then we have here a fish curry. Uh, and I, by the looks of it, I would say this is a coconut fish curry. Very flavorful, Flavor, flavorful. Okay, I'm sorry about that. And of course, like the main dish is a chicken. Mm, is it a chicken curry or a sambal chicken? Uh, it is definitely, I've had this dish before here at that stand. It's, this is the quite uh, the spiciest dish they have on the menu. 
And of course, we also have some boiled eggs, which always, you know, come in kind of well. And we have these thingies. These are like, they look like little burgers, like patties. They're inside, of course, they have also some, some onions maybe, or some spring onions, I'm not even sure, shallots. And, and yeah, they're like fried, I don't know if, if yeah. So this is kind of like, it's not hash brown. Yeah, it's, it's potatoes, they call it potatoes, but it's potatoes plus, you know. Okay, let's, uh, let's try to dig in. Okay, let's try, with, what should we start? Tell me, you don't know? Okay, doesn't matter. Anyway, we start with the rice. Well, maybe we will, usually we start with the chicken, you know, that's like, it's because it's like the main thing. Let's start with the, no, let's start with the chicken. Let's do, let's do that. Okay, let's just uh, get a chunk. Well, I'm eating with my hands, you know, it's a traditional food. So, let's get some chunk of that chicken, you know, and, mm, mm, sorry. And mmm, yeah, it's mmm, it's mmm, it's very good. And some of that sauce. Ah, uh, there's also some onions on it. Ah, oh, that looks really good. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, spicy sauce. This is a spicy thing, I tell you that already, because all you need to do is try the sauce, right? Mm, let's maybe get some, some vegetables with them as well. That as well. And I'll just to mix it a little bit up. It's just, mainly this is, of course, this is the most the most healthiest, but it's we consider it to be a side dish. Anyway, so let's try. Let's try, dig it. Let's try to, yeah, try to mix this up a little bit. You know, the oily, very oily, sambal sauce or yeah, whatever that is called. I could have asked, but I didn't. But I'm sure many of you Malaysians or even Indonesians uh, will be able to tell me. Okay, let's try this. Hmm. Mmm, mmm, mm, that's some good chicken here. That is some really good chicken. And actually, it's a bit spicy, you know. People always tell me, oh no, don't, don't, you know, when, whenever I go to, to a curry place, uh, let's say an Indian place, or, or uh, yeah, nasi champur place, or, you know, basically even, even if, I, if I order nasi lemak, people tell me, no, nah, it's spicy, you can't eat it. I say, no, 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 don't you worry, I can, I can eat spicy food because I've been eating spicy food forever, you know, even grew up in a spicy, spicy food kind of home, you know. And yeah, so no problem. Uh, but this one is actually, it is, it has some spice, you know, which is, you know, in Malaysia food is not as spicy, well, generally, of course, there's some spicy food, like in Thailand. Thailand, generally food is a bit more spicy. I'm not saying it's better. I like spicy, but I like not spicy as well. You know, there's lots of great Chinese food here that is not spicy, even in Malay food that is not spicy. It doesn't matter anyway. Let's try some some of that. Let's get some more chicken with that and some of that vegetable. Mmm, 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 mmm. Mm. It's fantastic. Mmm, absolutely fantastic. Yeah. Let's get some water. Try. Maybe try some of that fish. Okay. See this? Let me show you again. Some chunk of fish. I don't know what kind of fish this is. Then again, I'm pretty sure some of you can tell me. Ah, oh, that looks good. See, see, this is uh, big chunks of fish. Even with some with the skin on still. Maybe this is not for everybody. Me, I like it. Let's get some on that side of the white rice portion. Of course, I'll I've already destroyed most of it with that um, sauce, with that chicken sauce, with that sambal sauce. See, they also have some some kind of vegetables with in this. Let's try this. Let's get ah uh, yeah, there's some of the skin. Some of the I see for you, for those of you who don't who don't dig the skin, let's get some yeah some white some white fish. Hmm. Mm. Mm. Oh, you can taste, you can taste the coconut flavor right away. Mmm, good. They, yeah, there even be some, yeah, this actually, it actually sound, um, tastes a lot like, like some, some, some form of a Thai dish. Not as spicy in Thailand, this dish, the fish curry is, for me, in general in Thailand, is the most spicy item on the menu. So this would be a bit more, 
spicy in Thailand, but it's very similar. Of course, I'm of course the, the countries are neighbors, and when it, you know when it comes to history, you know there are some some you know things that cross you know. And yeah, but this is very good. I mean, there's no bones. Let's get some another. Mm, 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 mm. There's some. Hey, there's garlic in it, of course. But there's, I think there's garlic in all of the dish, uh, of the dishes. Mm. And yeah, there's some ginger in it, of course. Yeah, this is absolutely, absolutely mind-blowingly good, actually. It's like a little, a last one of it. Mmm, 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 mmm. Mmm, very, very good. Mm. It's finger licking good. You know, is that what they say? Isn't it? Let's try some of that tofu. Um, you know, see this? I got two of these. I'm not gonna eat this all by myself, you know. I'll share with my family. They'll eat some other things. It is a bit early. I like to get an early start. <laughs> Otherwise, they, they eat everything away. Anyway, so let's get part of this. We get the whole thing. Mm. Let's get some of that sauce, which seems to be very similar to the chicken sauce here. Like, yeah, this is like this. Yeah, this is like. Maybe a sam sambal sauce, something like that. Yeah. Lots of chili. You can see the pieces of the chili, you know, in the sauce. Now you can see that. Yeah. See, it's very, it's oily as well as this one, and it has has, has some onions as well. As well, of course, there is some ginger. There's definitely uh, garlic in it too. Well, let's give this a try. Mm. Mm. Mmm, 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 mm, very good. Mm. Yeah, it is very similar to that chicken sauce. It is not as spicy. It's a little bit less spicy and a little bit more sweet. Interesting, huh? Mmm. Okay, double. Then let's try one of these, you know. These, whatever, put potato thingies, I don't know what they're called. Maybe someone knows. It's, it's probably more of a snack, but I always they, they always have them at the lunch places, you know, where the, the buffet places, they always have these thingies. I don't know, this is, seems to be some of the rind. This is deep fried. <laughs> but yeah, let's try one of these. Mm. Let's try it. So I'll just eat this like. It tastes a lot like mashed potatoes with a with a bite to it. Maybe it would be good also with this some of the chili sauce or some of the sambal. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. nah, it's good because this is a little bit sweet. And of course these snack things, they're always good with a chili sauce that is a bit sweet. Mm -hmm. And that disgustingly full of food. Yeah, what do you have? Yeah, of course. This doesn't have to be, but I, I kind of like you know, just the boiled egg with everything, you know. Just put it here, put some sauce on it, and you know, just you know, break it, mash it up a little bit, maybe you know, whatever your heart desires. You know. Take it with a with a bite of rice. Mm. Oh boy, we all know what eggs taste like, right? Anyway, so yeah. That was great. That was a great meal, actually. I'm not gonna film the whole thing. Come on. Just wanna, yeah. See this? This is how, this is what I'm occupying myself with for the next, let's say, ten minutes, right? I'm not gonna wolf it all down. I'm, I'm gonna keep some of. Of course, I'm not gonna eat two pieces of tofu plus a full piece of chicken plus a full full piece of fish. No, I'm not. I am the sharing kind. Oh uh, yeah. I definitely, you know, at the yeah at the Jalan Kota. Laksamana, do I pronounce that correctly? The stand you'll find there, and this is a definitely 10 out of 10 points. This is such amazing Nazi Champur. It is popular, I mean, and it is popular for, some, for a reason. Also, it is quite cheap. And I'm talking, you can eat there, you know, for three ringgit, for like a full meal, or four ringgit, you know, depends, you know, if you want some, some chicken with that, or, you know, you know what I mean. They have 
very cheap uh, drinks as well so it is just basically you can sit down it's just a, it's like the kind of like industry hole in the wall kind of types it is really really good you know I can recommend it do find out where it is and go and try it and tell me you don't love that place I mean I know people fight about food about opinions you know but there it will be gonna it's gonna be hard to you know make a fuss you know to push me into conflict because this food is amazing okay all right anyway so let's call it a a food vlog let's call it a food video you know I will be showing you lots of other foods in the city of Malacca because just like Penang it is a very famous city for foods I mean for me the whole country is famous for foods but you know inside people are very proud of their you know Malaccan cuisine or Penang cuisine and that is okay you know they should stand in competition right anyway okay you guys take care and bon appetit yeah bye bye